Where, where, where did you run off to, darling? I'm terribly sorry for that angry phone call earlier. I just wanted you to come see me so badly that I let my emotions get the better of me. Please come out. I promise I won't hurt you. Please, dear. Darling, come out. I know you always love to play hide-and-seek. Oh, is that what you're doing? You want me to find you? <laughs> well, all right then. If you insist so much, I'll come find you. Do you remember, darling, all that time ago? <laughs> it feels like centuries since we last saw each other. Do you remember this place? It was the site of our first date. Ah, yes. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. We came here with some friends and messed around. Everyone else wanted to fool around and get intimate as a joke in this place. But we were different. We were... too shy to go to that base. When we went into the back, do you remember what I told you? I love you. I always have. Oh, no, 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 darling. Why are you trying to run? It's me, your boyfriend. Huh? What do you mean I died? Silly, I'm right here. Eight years ago? No, no, it's been... Um... Uh... uh oh, you're serious? I see. So that's why you felt it was fine to betray me. Don't play dumb, sweetie. I've seen you with that other boy. No matter what happens, we will always be together. That's what you said. Those were your words. Sweetie, you are so cute when you try to lie, but you have a very adorable tell. Your fingers start to fidget. Sometimes I wondered if you were just nervous around me. But then I caught on, and it became a fun little game of cat and mouse. Hmm? What happened to me? <laughs> Darling, I know I might look a little different, but it's really all right. I'm perfectly okay now. Ah, <sighs> I guess since I never saw you... Well, you never saw me until now. No one ever found me. You see, after we made that unbreakable promise to one another, I went back to this place and figured I'd try to snag one of these suits for your birthday. I know you found these guys oddly cute, and I wanted to surprise you. Who knows? Maybe we could have made out in the back of this place when it was still open, just like the others did back when we were too shy to. Anyway, I got inside this suit and was ready to make my way over to you, my adorable cutie. But then I heard some strange noises and just like that, the suit snapped shut. Killing me instantly. I never knew what happened until I woke up, stuck inside this suit. How? Well, I like to think my love for you kept me bound to this world. And since you came here after I messaged you, clearly you feel the same. You thought it was him. Yes, well, I had to change that fact. 
Remember those murders that happened 30 years ago? I figured I'd pay tribute to such an event and brought him here and did the same to him. Oh, sweetie, honey, please don't cry. He was no good for you, I swear it. When he got here, he had some girl drive him here. He was cheating on you. So, I had to put a stop to it. I lured him back here and killed him and his girl. Darling, please, don't say such horrible words. I love you, and I want you to be safe and loved. I might have died a while ago, but your love brought me back. We were meant to be together. Don't worry, sweetie. I know what'll change your mind. Darling, it's useless to struggle. Though, it is adorable seeing you squirm. It's like when I used to kiss your neck. You'd wriggle and squirm with how much you liked it. It was so cute. <laughs> is that blushing I see? No need to pretend, dear. Oh, here we are. Yup, it's a suit, just like the one on me now. I'm going to join us for eternity. Before we were a couple, but now we will be soulmates. Once you come back with my love, we will be able to live here eternally. Forever. It'll only hurt a tiny bit. Trust me, honey, you won't feel anything once it activates. Now then, in we go. Sadly, no one will hear those cute screams of yours. I'll see you soon, darling. Nighty-night.